Hi everyone. Hey guys. We're at Dollar Tree today. We are going to be purchasing some of our cruising essentials for at both. a budget. Yep, for both men and women because I'm finding a lot of people aren't touching on the things that guys need also. So hopefully I can give you guys some perspective there. Yeah, so hopefully we can save a whole bunch of money. We are going to go in. We're going to check out all the items and pick up all of our stuff because we have a cruise coming up in less than two weeks. Yeah, buddy. All, all right. right. So let's go. All right, guys, so here at the dollar store, I like to get my hair ties, some claw clips, and just all kinds of other accessories. And you know, it is a dollar, and it is such a good buy for all of these, especially when it is windy on a cruise ship. I always have to have hair ties. Sometimes I have really, really cute scrunchies. And when I get my hair done in the morning, I always use a claw clip. So yeah, these are a couple of items I definitely love to have with me. All right, boys and girls, here we are. Something to help us with our dirty laundry problems. We've all got it. We've all got dirty laundry. Some of the solutions that you can have are you can use the pop-up hamper. Keep it in like your closet so this way your stuff is nice and organized and out of the way. Or you can use a mesh laundry bag here. So if you need to take your stuff down to the laundry room when you're there, you can easily do so. So yeah, good find guys, and it's only a buck twenty-five, so fine. Okay, so some great finds are these travel essential bottles. So these are the TSA approved um, travel bottles. They come in the little, uh, what is it, little spray bottles and just the regular bottles. So you can put your own um, shampoo and conditioners in these bottles. So that these are a really good find for the price. But I also found something that I've actually never seen here before, which is these vacuum storage bags. They are a um, single piece and I I'm not sure exactly how it works. I believe you, oh, you attach your vacuum up to it. Oh, that's cool. That's an old school hack there. Right? Yeah. Uh. But definitely something, especially if you are coming on a plane, you know, definitely like the weight and the size of your suitcase is an issue. You can always take them down the size and then just pop them in to your bags. So when I used to travel all the time to Thailand, we actually used a lot of these because we would go for like three months at a time. So we had a whole bunch of these vacuum seal bags and it worked like a charm. All right, hey guys. So, great find here also is I found, not my personal favorite, but my son's favorite is the antiperspirant and deodorant, Old Spice. It's only a buck, travel size, nice and small. And the one that smells really good. But if you're a little bit more picky like me, they've got a whole wide selection here. They got some like Dove right here, the roll-on care. They've got some dry spray, whatever you need. So, got some good selections here. All right, hey, another great find here is you never know it until you actually need it. First aid supplies. This could save you a trip to the medical area of the ship, or even if you're on an excursion, you never know if you get like a blister or get like a cut of or a nick of some sort. Boom, first aid kit right there. They've got a couple different ones to choose from. This one's got 21 different items in there. This one's 15. Nice and thin, fits easily in whatever you decide to pack it with. I think I'm gonna go with the 21. And then something that a lot of people forget till they actually need it is maybe like a pain reliever. I would like to go with some name brand stuff. So I'm gonna go with maybe some Tylenol PM. Might help me sleep if uh, I'm having a headache or something or it gets a little loud in the room. And then maybe some regular Tylenol for during the daytime. Don't exactly wanna fall asleep during the day. So I'll take some of this. 
So yeah, good find, guys. And then, oh, hey, check this out. For those who have medications and need to take medications on a schedule, they've got all these different little nifty little packs here, only a buck. And, you know, got morning, night, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and so forth. Yeah, these are nice little cases in here. So good find also. All right, and another thing that I would suggest getting, but this is four seventy five here, so maybe you want to get it at a different store, but something for your stomach. Obviously, we know eating on a cruise ship, we tend to overeat and we eat kind of like everything. So getting something for your stomach is good. Um, they do have a, several different options here. I'm, I've never heard of the brand, so I'm not sure exactly how well that would be. But I saw something right here. Motion sickness. This is 25 milligrams of meclizine. That is a motion sickness medication. Um, I'm, I'm not sure about the brand. I'm not sure if I would want to purchase this here, but it's definitely something to keep in mind. I would have to research this brand. So, but yeah, look at all of this stuff. We are going to shop some more, so we'll get back to with you here in a minute. So when you are on a cruise and you are on an excursion, a lot of people get really hot and sweaty, especially in the summertime. It is like 90 plus degrees. You are sweating and people tend to get a little stinky. So look what I found. They are wipes. Yeah, it's tagged. It's probably for men, but they're kind of like little body wash cloths that you can have in your bag with you when you're um, on your excursions. So you can clean yourself off and smell nice and fresh. And we've got lotion, little travel size, some mouthwash. Definitely gotta get these. But there's different brands of lotion also. There's Corel, um, some cocoa butter, shampoo and conditioner and then we've got all of the toothbrush and toothpaste right here they even got the ones for kids um, the good thing about having this section right here is a look at the size of some of these that you can get for 2.4 ounces this will definitely last a whole week. I mean, if there's more than two or three of you, you can definitely grab a couple of these and new toothbrushes. And here is a travel set toothbrush and the little cases. And they've got little cases right here. So something, something that I actually like is I like fresh contact lens cases, especially when you're traveling. So here is a pack of five of them for $1.25. This is a great deal. Hey guys. So something that people commonly forget about is us. We need some care also. For example, you can get a decent travel size for $1.25, full Barbasol shaving gel and stay nice and smooth. And then you got a whole selection of razors here, some disposable razors. I like to bring my own because I'm not a fan of the disposable ones, but this is definitely a good value. And then you get some good Barbasol ones here, or you can even get a 10 pack. Boom. So if you're on a long journey and you just need something quick, this is a good solution. I have bought these on the cruise ship before. A lot more expensive, trust me. So better get them here before you're out at sea and you really need something. So um, also you got Q-tips. All right. Hey guys. So a little something y'all don't know about me is I tend to get hangry. And so I need little snacks every once in a while just to just keep the beast down. So, 
little travel hack so you don't spend an arm and a leg out there. Stock up on some snacks before you get on your plane, you get on your excursions, or hell, even just when you're just needing a little something extra in between trips to the buffet. Huh? So, example, check out these nuts. Honey roasted cashews. Creamy. So, get some there, some pistachios. I do like corn nuts, but I'm a bigger fan over here. Check it out. Beef jerky, baby. Yeah. So we're gonna stock up on some of this. You know, and another tip, this is good for trips to even going to Disney or just going somewhere with the family and little road trips. Save a few bucks here. And keep this in your bag, because you never know when any one of us uh, turn into our diva selves and uh, get hangry. So it's a good buy. I'm gonna get a couple. Let's get teriyaki. So while he was over there talking about him being hangry, <laughs> Let's be real. I think he was talking more about me being hangry than anything. So I do suffer from um, the hangrynitis and I do get pretty cranky. So we're in the snack aisle and while he's over there getting all his nuts and stuff, I am definitely going to check out all of this other stuff right here, especially. We call it the emergency beef jerky. Why do we call it the emergency beef jerky? Is, well, during an emergency situation when somebody is acting up, we get our snacks. So something that I just came across were these voodoo potato chips. Have you guys ever had these voodoo potato chips? I really, really like them. Um, I really recommend getting some and trying some. But they also have pretzels and everything here too. If you guys, um, especially the ones that are like driving down from out of state, you can definitely get one of those and you know, get the kids a little in between snack. But now we are gonna try to catch up with Dustin because I feel like he must have found something because he went around the corner really fast. Busted. Getting some treats. So we definitely like to show our gratitude to the staff that works on cruise ships. So I suggest getting thank you cards. They come in a pack of six and they're super cute. So you can write a little note for your room attendant or just anybody give them a little tip if you want to leave it in your room for them it is such a great find and such a great idea to show your gratitude i really like this i think i'm gonna go with this Chair decorations, table decorations, little hang fringe things. That's fun for hanging from the ceiling. Uh, yeah, you can do all kinds of stuff actually. More fringe type stuff. Streamers. Who don't like some beads? And then. You know. Brush off my crown. Let's celebrate. Happy birthday. Just celebration in general. Some candles. Can't bring candles. Can't have a flame on the ship, so. Don't even try. Uh, yeah, let's head to the next aisle over and see what else I got. Get a pretty good amount of balloons. This is more than enough to fill a cabin. 20 balloons, 20 
different colors, tissue paper if you want to present some gifts. Who doesn't like getting gifts? Something that I have to have on all cruises is packs of tissue. We actually went to one of the cruise ports and the bathroom there did not have any tissue. So definitely get um, some of these packs. So uh, this one right here is a pack of eight and this one's only a pack of three. So I'm gonna go with the pack of eight. <laughs> no way. Look at these. Twinkies, ice latte, Snickers, ice latte, Twix. Who doesn't love Twix? Cinnamon Toast Crunch. What? Oh man. I don't know though. I don't know if my tummy can handle that. I hope you enjoyed our trip to the dollar store. I hope that you found our video beneficial to you on your next cruise and helps you save some money make sure you like and subscribe to our video so we can bring you additional content like this until next time bye bye sailors